أعوذ بالله من الشيطان الرجيم بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم أعوذ بالله من الشيطان الرجيم بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم All right. Ali, can you please read the title yes. of this surah? Yes, sir. Surah Al Surah Al Lahab Makkiya. No, please. Bismillah. Yeah, Bismillah ar Rahman ar Rahim. Bismillah ar Rahman ar Rahim. Read the first verse. Tabat yada abi lahab yun wa tab. Okay. Read slowly. Relaxed. Again. Okay. Tabat yada abi lahab yun wa tab. What is the difference between the speed of the first way you read and the second way? I don't find any difference. Slow down, man. Don't rush it. Again. Okay. Tabat. Yada Abi Lahab Yuwatab Watab S Watab Ni Itanam Don't uh stretch the sound too much. Okay. It should be subtle. It should not be so elaborate. It should not be so prominent. It should be subtle. Uh Watab B like this. Watab. 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 Press the bar more. Watab. 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 Yeah, that's better. I read the verse again. Tab. Yada. Abi. Lahab. Watab. Slowly, man, slowly. What the b? What the b? That's it. Again, same verse. Tabat yada abi lahab yun wa tab. No, but you. Press the bar more. And slowly. Again. Again, same verse. Read slowly. Don't rush it. Tabat yada abi lahab yun wa tab. नहीं बच्चे, the a sound should be at the end. तब बत यदा अभिलाभियों और तब read in this speed. तब बत यदा अभिलाभियों और तब yeah that's फिर बार read the next verse. Hiba, are you there? Sir, Hiba is gone somewhere. She is coming in one minute. Tamsila, read the next verse. Okay. Ah, I said read that. Are you even listening? Okay, okay, next one. Ma aguna anhu ma luhu wa ma kasab. Again, slowly. I said again slowly. Ma aguna anhu ma luhu wa ma kasab. 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 Say kasab. Kasab. Yeah. Now there is a difference between watab and kasab. Watab. B and kasab. There is a difference. Tamsila, can you tell me the difference between yes, the sounds? There is a shadda on watab and there is a, and on the second one there is a, it is without a shadda. Yeah, it is without a shadda and this will turn into sukoon. 
So the Kalkala of Shadda, if we are stopping, is a bit different. As compared okay. to the Kalkala of Sukoon. In the Kalkala of Shadda, when we are stopping, normally on Shadda we don't apply Kalkala. But if we are stopping, we will apply Kalkala. But that kind of Kalkala will be more pressed. And okay. and uh, the Kalkala of Sukoon will be normal Kalkala. This is the difference between these two words. Are you getting my point, all of you guys? Yes, yes sir. sir. For the sake of explanation and understanding, we will make up a word. To clarify it further. If we are stopping here, we will read this word as Kasab Tamsila. Read Kasab. Kasab. But if we are stopping here, it will be Kasab. Kasab. Yeah, now all of you, can you feel the difference between the stopping of here and here? Yes. Yeah. You have to keep this difference in mind. All right. Hibba, have you returned? Yes, she has returned. Okay, Hibba, please read this verse. After Raul Billah and Bismillah. Raul Billah, Bismillah, this verse. Cannot hear you. Hibba, come closer to the mic, please. Yes. A'udhu billahi min ash-shaytan ar-rajim Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim You are making the ha of Allah sharper don't do that again Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim Yeah Sayasla naram zata lahab Didn't we read this surah before Yes Yes Read the verse again carefully. Sayasla naran zata lahab. Naran, make the raw heavier. Naran zata lahab. Where are you touching your tongue in Zal? Where are you touching your trunk in the letter Zal? On the edge of the upper teeth. Okay, but it should be more softer, more gentler. Read yes. the verse again. Sayasla naram zata lahab. All right, Ahmad. Read the next one. Come on, are you kidding me? Don't you know you have to do something on bar here when we are stopping? What happens to the kasra of bar when we stop? Ahmad, only you tell me. Kalkala. What happens to the kasra of bar when we stop here? It finishes. It finishes. What finishes? The kasra. No, you are wrong. If it ends, as you say, then ba should be silent because ba does not have any sign according to your logic. So, what will happen? Then we should say like this. Hamalatahato. Because we, you, according to you, the kasra ends here. But the, this is not the case. You tell me now. What happens to the kasra of Ba? You can seek help from your siblings. Yes. What's 
this word uh, and at the end the signs will be finished <laughs> the signs will be finished and there will be a sukoon on it yes so the kasra will be replaced by sukoon it will not finish at all but it will change into sukoon when we are stopping now did you get my point ahmad yes yes so when we it turns into sukoon by is one of which letters which what is the group's name the letter ba belongs to kalkala letters yeah so why didn't you apply kalkala here when we were stopping ha huh? read the words again carefully wa amra'atuhu hammalat al hatab not at all again wa amra'atuhu hammalat al hatab okay ali read the last one ali okay slowly but ha This one is softer this one is sharper distinguish between the two clearly again fi ji diha hablum mim masad press the mim more please again fi ji diha hablum mim masad okay Surat An-Nasr. Read all of you. Surat An-Nasr. Ahmad only you read. Surat An-Nasr. Surat An-Nasr. Madaniya. Madaniya. Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. All of you guys. Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Ahmad, only you read. Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. No, but you. Make the hash happen, and I don't know why your voice is breaking. Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Mm-hmm. Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Yeah. Okay, Ahmad. Focus. Oh, rest of you, be silent, or this week's points will be cancelled for you. Anyone who talks in the background. Ida ja a. Ida ja. Ahmad only you read Ida ja a Ida ja a Nasrullahi Nasrullahi wal fath wal fath wal fath wal fath no bachi wal fath wal fath yeah that's the thing wal fath wal fath all right ahmad only you read the entire verse now idha jaa nasrullah wal fath tamsila only you follow ahmad 
Iza jaa nasrullahi wal fath Iza jaa nasrullahi wal fath Wal fath The ha sound should be at the end Wal fath Yeah wal fath Wal fath Yeah that's it Tamsila again Iza jaa nasrullahi wal fath why are you in a rush? Don't you see the big mud here? Don't you know we have to stretch the jaw for four seconds? Are your four seconds equal to one second only? Don't do that. Again. Come on. What about the ha at the end? Why is it silent? It should be red. The ha sound should be there. The dhamma turns into sukoon does not mean that the ha is diminished. Completely. The ha sound will still remain there. Come on, again. Again. Hello. Yeah, that's better. All right. Hibba, you follow Tamsila now. No, but she ha sound at the end. Wal fat. Wal fat. Yeah, again. Hiba again. That's better. Ali, you follow Hibba now. All right. Ahmad, you read again this verse. All of you follow Ali. Follow Ahmad. Tamsila, you read it again. All of you follow Tamsila. All right. Hibba, you read it. Hold on. Wal Fath, the ha sound should be prominent. Your voice is fluctuating. I am not sure why. Is your internet working properly today? Yes, sir. I'm not sure what's the problem then. Please uh, use an external mic if it if you can. All right, Heba, read it properly again. That's better. Follow Heba, all of you. Hello. Ali, you read it. All of you follow Ali. Can't hear any voice, only Ahmad's voice was audible. Again, follow Ali properly, all of you. Uh -huh. Can't hear the ha at the end. I'm not sure why. Follow Ali again properly. Ali, read. Yeah, that's it. Okay, Ali, follow along with me. Wara Aitan Nasa. 
If the last letter of a word has double fatha on it and if we are stopping there then one fatha will be removed and that letter will be stretched for one second regardless whether there is alif next to it or not alif does not matter here the thing is that the double fatha matters if we are stopping here and the last letter has a double fatha one fatha will be removed one fatha will remain and we will stretch it for one second tamsila you tell me what did i just say whenever there is uh, one fatha uh, uh, while uh, at the end at uh, the last letter and so we remove the fatha and stretch it for one second bravo you said when there is one fatha at the end is it correct Sorry, no. did i say this ahibba you tell double. me no double fatha okay double fatha So we remove the double fatha and stretch the uh, letter for one second. Hiba, you tell me what did Tamsila say? Whenever there is double fatha on any letter, on any letter in the last, we remove the double fatha and stretch the stretch it for one second. You said on any letter. Does it also mean that if in this word double fatha is on a wow, we will apply the same rule? Hiba, you tell me. on the last letter ha ah, not on any letter but the last letter ali tell me what did tamsila and hibba say at the last letter if there is double fatha then then we remove red we remove what the double uh, double fatha oh Sorry. my god oh my you changed the complete story man <laughs> You you completely change the whole scenario here. Is there which right at one? Come on, Ali. Ahmed, you tell me what did Hiba and Tamsila say? Whenever there is double fatha on the last letter, we uh, we change it, we change it into we change it we change it and we stretch it for one second. Bravo, both Ali and Ahmed. Kudos to you, both of you guys. First of all, the first question to arise in mind: Why do we need to change it? You did not uh, tell me the purpose of changing. Tamsila, tell us. Oh no, no. Because, because, yeah. I have asked you. You have not answered the question. Tamsila, you tell me now. Why do we change the double fatha into single fatha? The reason, the purpose. because uh or is, uh, or better question will be like this when do we there is a special moment when we remove the uh, fatha when do we do it when there is uh, a is an, finishing uh, and alif after it uh, no bachche you did you missed it heba you tell me whenever ayat is finishing haan ji uh, somewhat better better answer according to the, as compared to others actually the thing is you did not listen to me properly again i will say if the last letter has a double fatha on it and when we are stopping there stopping is the purpose not on any other occasion for example if double fatha is on any other uh, word in and it is coming in the middle of the verse and we are not stopping there why do we need to remove it according to your definitions according to ahmed and tamsila and uh, uh, tamsila's definition and ali's definition why do we need to stop there if uh, for example here koi ron there is double fatha why do we need to remove uh, this fatha from it single fatha and then single fatha remains and we are stretching why do we need to do this in the middle of the verse according to your logic according to ahmad's logic and tamsila's logic and ali's logic the thing is when we are stopping then it happens you have to keep all the facts in mind
All right. Ahmad, repeat after me. Fasab bih. Fasab bih. Fasab bih. Fasab bih. Bihamdi. Bihamdi. Ha, must be sharper. Bihamdi. Bihamdi. Rabbika. Rabbika. Now listen closely. Wastaghfir. Wastaghfir. Ah, 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 ah. At the end, ha sound should be audible. Although we will not read Dhamma because we are stopping on the small ta sign. It's also called Waqf Mutlik, but you don't need to remember the term. You can also say it's recommended stop or simply the small ta stop. So on the small ta, we are stopping here and the Dhamma is turning into Sukoon, but Ha will be, has to be audible still. And Ha will be read from the chest. Remember that. So it is Wastaghfir. 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 That's better. Wastaghfir. Wastaghfir. Innahu. Innahu. Kana. Kana. Tawwaba. Tawwaba. What is happening to the double fatha ba? Tell me, Ahmad. When we are stopping and the last word is double fatha, the double fatha changes and we stretch the word for one second. Not the word, but the letter, the last letter. letter. The letter, last Yeah. All right. Ahmad, please try to read this verse in continuity. Again. 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 follow along, Ahmad. <laughs> Hibba, follow them, Sila. Why did you stress the noon? Why should you say ka na? Why did you do that? Noon fatha na, not na. Again, Hibba. In in Fasab Dish Bihamdi Robbika was talk fit in Nahukana Tawaba. You made the same mistake again, no difference. Fasab Dish Bihamdi Robbika was talk fit in Nahukana Tawaba. Who are the two people talking in the background? Ali. Ali. I am clearly listening the sound of an a bigger boy. Ali is a younger one. They both they both are talking. They both are talking. All right. I was listening to for two <laughs> weeks. Both of the points both of those points are cancelled for two weeks. Uh, yeah, Ahmad and Ali. For both of them, the points are cancelled for two weeks. All right. Hibba, read it again, please. Focus. That's better. Ali, you follow Hibba now. 
All of you follow me. Iza ja anasrullahi wal fath. Iza ja anasrullahi wal fath. Wa ra'aytan nasa yadukhuluna fi dinillahi afwaja. Wa ra'aytan Fasabbih <laughs> From Surah An Nasr till Surah An Nas, you will read all the surahs. Send me the voice recording of all of these surahs. Uh, this is the assignment for all of you guys. Okay. <sighs> All right, Ahmed, just uh, on your own PC, uh, open the file, Arabic letters. Open it and start reading from page number one. Rules of studying, start reading from there. Okay. Love. Yeah. Okay, I will not look. Yeah, Ahmad, please read. Loud, read it of, out. Yeah. Rules of studying. Do not look here or there. Look at the screen. Read loudly. Don't read in a low voice. Read slowly. Don't read fast. Whatever you read, keep it in mind too. Do the assignments daily. Whatever you study becomes your assignment too. Next one. We don't use force in soft letters. Hard letters are read with force. Hard letters are read with force. Hard letters are read with force. Ah, this is perfect tense. Next. Yes, sir. In heavy letters, there is an O sound. Light letters don't have sound in them hmm. next I lift the soft and light we read it by making our lips closed we re read it softly and lightly hmm. next ah, soft and light hmm. next the tip of the tongue will gently touch the Hill behind the upper front tooth is mm. the soft and light. Tip of the tongue will touch the edge of the upper front tooth teeth gently and softly. Jim soft and light, ha sharp and light. Next. <laughs> Didn't you open the file in your laptop? We don't have the file. Uh, okay, open, open. Subhanallah. Tha is read from the middle throat. It should be read with force. It should be as sharp as a sword. It is a light letter. For hard, heavy, scratchy. It is read from the Top throat with force. The scratchy sound in top throat should be dominant and clear. 
dal light more soft in dal the tip of the tongue will touch the will touch at the place where we read ta but where we read ta from it will be more where we read ta from. where we read ta from but it will be more gently yeah. where we read ta from but it will be gentler next tip next tip of the tongue will touch at the edge of the upper front two teeth like in sa gently and more softly wo पढ़ लिया सर ये जाल पढ़ो ना पढ़ो ना जाल आपने नहीं आपने जाल खा गए जाल यू एक्सप्लेन द लेटर जाल बट यू डिड नॉट रीड द आई कुडंट हियर यू बिकॉज़ योर वॉइस इज फ्लक्चुएटिंग कंटीन्यूअसली एनीवे रॉ नेक्स्ट रॉ हैवी एंड सॉफ्ट जा लाइट एंड आर्ड देयर विल बी अ लिटिल गैप बिटवीन द अपर एंड लोअर टी the will have a whistling sound it has a z sound in it the tongue must not touch anywhere read with force read with force read with force hmm seen hard light a b c seen is also seen is also read, read with, with force. force yeah like za like za seen also has a whistling sound and the upper and lower teeth have gap hmm. sheen hmm. light hmm. the sheen sound should be loud and clear red with force fod heavy and hard in the letter so tip of the tongue touches back side of the lower front two teeth with force it is hard and heavy and the whistling sound will be there but is weak hmm. there are three whistling letters dal si sod come on so, again 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 read za, again ha sa za ni sod to heavy and hard in the letter to as compared to more area of the tip of the tongue will be touching at the hill behind the upper front teeth we will use force in reading it tongue must touch hard wo have so heavy soft tip of the tongue will touch back side of the upper front teeth gently and softly ein light ein is red from the middle throat ein heavy soft it is red from the top throat from the place where kha is read also it should be red soft tip of the belly where kha is red also bhai where kha is red also it should be red softly but heavily fa light the upper teeth will touch the wet inside area of the lower lip the sound of fa should be clear fa pan or cough what well, what's the Heavy. name what is the name of the school in which you guys study meritorious mm mm-hmm. is it an english school no mix mix okay. it is good people speak in yes mm-hmm. cough okay heavy and hard cough is cough, cough is red red from cough is red from the back side of the roof you will feel as if some kind of force is hitting here while you read this letter cough soft light calf is read softly and lightly and as compared to cough it is read from the front a bit hi mere allah to it is read from the front a bit yaar what are you it doing it is read from the front a bit hmm lam mim noon wow make your lips fully round while reading wow ha if we place the e of he with an a then it becomes ha we read it from the chest it short it should not be sharp like ha hamza ya wad heavy soft left side of the tongue will gently touch left roof of the mouth we will read it heavily should be soft the sound of this letter resembles wad 
Mm -hmm. All right. So, Kamsila, read all the alphabets. Okay. Alif, the, 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 jim, ha, ho, dal, dal, ho, za, seen. Seen. seen, seen should be read with force. Seen like this, like the sound seen. of a snake. Okay, seen, sheen, sword, rod, go, go, green, green, fur, off, calf, lamb, beam, noon, well, her. Hamza, yeah. How about you read? Alif, ba, ta, sa, jim, ha. No. Sharper, man. Come on. Ha, ho, dal, zal, ro, za. Za. Should be more harder. Za. Za. Seen, sheen, sword, rod, paw. In sword, where are you touching your tongue? Heba. In the lower teeth, back side. Okay, sword. And where are you touching your tongue in sword? In sword, we are touching our tongue on the yes, roof side. of the left side, on the mouth. Mm -hmm. okay. left side. Next one. After a lot. Yes. For raw rain, rain, fur, off, calf, lamb, meme, noon, wow, ha, hamza, yeah. Okay, Ali, you read all the letters. Okay, sir. Alif, ba, the sa jing ha ho dal dal wo the sin shin pod wo to wo ain ain fa ko ka Lam, Mim, Noon, Wow, Ha, Hamza, Yeah. All right. Okay, so all of you know what is your assignment, inshallah, meet you tomorrow, wish you best of luck. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullah. Wa alaikum wa rahmatullah.